Welcome to another episode of Watch Once Over. My name is Big E. We're going to be looking at this Joseph Boulevard chronograph today. And this is in the Joseph Boulevard uh, collection. And this watch can be purchased at azfinetime.com. Here's the information. And this watch comes in at a retail price of $24.95. And this is available now and they have both colorways. Now, this watch is a... Uh, let's say a quintessential type chronograph uh, based off of the style of a 7750 Valjo. This one is sporting a Salita SW500 uh, and you have the day date. And I like this uh, better than a lot of 70, uh, 7750 Valjos because you can control the day and the date uh, mechanism with, when the crown is out in the second position. I mean, yeah, in the second position instead of having that extra uh, pusher on the case so that's that's a plus now you get a sapphire front and then a mineral half back then on the back you have joseph boulevard 1875 limited edition of 350 and this is an all swiss made watch um one of the things i don't like about this is that the movement is limited in uh the decoration you only have a sunburst uh, style signed uh, rotor on there. And you can't see the rest of the um, decoration because it is sparsely decorated. But I guess it will suffice. Um, I do like the dial on here. And it does look good. And this watch does offer a lot of wrist presence for the size. Um, Valjo and SW500 are pretty thick movement. So as you can see, it does have um, a, some enormity to it. Um, let's do a quick measurement on here. 42 millimeters in diameter. Uh, about 16, 17 millimeters thick. Then the lug to lug is going to be only about a 47. So the lug to lug is great. My, my wrist is 7.25 inches, and I'll show you what it looks like on my wrist. That's what it looks like on my wrist. So it does have that uh, shorter lug-to-lug -lug for a bigger watch, so it'll fit a variety of um, wrist sizes. And that's good. Now you get a, a twin trigger signed deployant on this leather faux alligator strap. That is nice. And I believe it's a 22 mil lug width. Yeah, 22 mil lug width. So easy to find uh, different straps for this. And like I said, you do get a day date complication. Cam actuated chronograph, which is a standard affair. You do get a, a tachymeter scale around the outside. Moving, let's show you that. You get a tachymeter. A scale running outside you get those uh, looks like chemically uh, blued hands I don't they have too much of a sheen I, they don't look like they're uh, heat blued hands I think they're all chemically blued uh, real nice enamel style dial on here and maybe it isn't enamel dial or enamel hands but I couldn't find a, a ton of information on it but the printing on this watch is excellent and um, it's coming in at a fair price now you get a signed uh, bull of a crown. Let's see if I can get that to focus in there. It's hard to show up because it's very faint. And then you get these rectangular pushers on the end. The case uh, shape and lugs are all of high polish. Really decent uh, looking. You get a curved um, sapphire crystal in the front with anti-reflective coating. And the watch is just a decent looking chronograph. Um, I think it would have been cooler if it had black sub dials, had a little panda effect, but it is what it is. And this is a limited edition Joseph Boulevard collection, but you can pick this up at azfinetime.com. My name is Biggie. That's the watch once over for today. And I'll talk to you guys later. God bless and have a great one.